What's up everybody? It's Illumilani back with another video. Been a while, hasn't it? What can I say? Nine to five suck the life out of me. But today, I was feeling pretty good, so I decided, hmm, that Alice Madness Returns series needs another part, so here I am. I even did my makeup for this, that's how you know it's fucking real. And listen, if any of you come for the fact that my eyeliner is not matching, it will be considered a hate crime. And you will be banned from my comments. Anyways, fuck it, part six I think we're on, right? Let's get it fucking started. That's my thumbnail. So I think what we're doing this time is fighting the colossal ruin. Sorry I made you guys wait for that. Kind of like a cliffhanger, right? Is it really an Illumilani Alice Manus Returns video if the game doesn't crash? Let me get it back up again. Nice. It's working. Fuck. Fuck. You know what? I never- I'm never prepared for this shit. I'm never prepared. God. Okay. Kill me. I need a moment. I need a moment. I feel like I'm shaking like a chihuahua right now. Let's hope I've gotten good enough at this game that this shit is no problem. Oh! Oh! Die! Die! Oh my god. Kill me. I hate you! I hate you! I hate you! I hate you! I wish you would kill yourself! No! I'm glad I'm not taking a hit count for this one like I did last time because I feel like that would have just been a total nightmare. <gasps> no. Why did it growl at me? No, 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 no. Where'd it go? What? Did I just kill it? I don't even think that was its death animation. And it doesn't like go for a round two. What the fuck? My mind is literally blown right now. Okay. Well, that was not that hard. I'm sorry I made you guys wait that long for such an anticlimactic fight. It kind of just stood there. I wasn't expecting that. Oh, that's lovely. That's very pleasant and wholesome for the family. So we're going to go ahead and finish this level. Didn't like that noise. Scared me so much I fell right off the edge. Oh, a Rachel room! I think this is the fourth one. So yeah, we're gonna finish this level, and then we're gonna go ahead and start the Asian level and get a little ways in. Not sure how much yet. I don't really remember that level a whole lot, so I guess I'll find out once we get there. Rachel room, here we go. I hope this is a time one so I can just keep running. There's no time to waste. I think it is. No oh, nah, fuck. Ah, shit. That's the bigger guys. Oh god. These are like all the villains I used to be scared of. I bet the first time I played this I shit my pants. Fuck. I forgot how to open my thing. This is, has it been that long that I forget how to dodge? Kill him! Kill him! Kill him! <laughs> Get him down! Damn, he really, he really just helped me kill his brother. I guess they're not brothers. They're different species, but, you know, they're on the same team. That's not very Nakama of you. And there we go. Oh my god, really? More? Oh, we got them both, we got them both. Okay, we got them both down to their halfway points. Oh wow, oh wow, I'm going crazy on them, I'm going crazy! Another one? Okay, that's just bullshit. This game heard how much I hated the fucking big ruin ones and it was like, give them- Oh god, this is annoying. I'm tired, I don't want to be here anymore. Nice. See, I wish these enemies would just get it together and realize that I'm the protagonist. Their life would be much easier if it were. No, that was only three-fourths of the rows. Shit. That can't be the fourth Radula room then. I feel like I missed one. Let me check my little chart. I'll see right now. Radula rooms. Yeah, damn. I think I missed a Radula room then. Hold on. I want to see where it was. Radula rooms, Alice, Madness, Returns. Okay, the obvious Radula room. Statue in the center of the town. Oyster garden beds available. I think I missed the one in the oyster room. Hey, editing me. Can you check on that? Can you check to see? if I got a Radula room from there and let me know. But anyways, yeah, I tried my best. Loot. Do I have enough to upgrade yet? Let's find out. No, I do not. Where is it though? That's right there. That's kind of crazy. They really hit that one. Did you guys fucking hear that? Did you hear the fucking groaning fish in here? Please don't make that noise. Every picture tells a story. Sometimes we don't like the ending. Sometimes we don't understand it. What the fuck, man? I don't like that. But what did she- Oh, did he open this? Yeah, that's fucking horrifying. I- I don't remember that. <laughs> no, no, no. No, no, no. I need to go back here. Where was the- It was over here. Jesus, fuck. That's like- That give- That's like viscerally uncomfortable. I don't know why. Usually I don't give a shit about like gore like that, but uh, that's horrible. I think it's because I hear him groaning in my fucking ear. Shut up. Be in pain quietly. And and we are back. Time for what I think is the end of this level. It's so much scarier in here. Can I talk to you, my favorite squid man? Or can I blow you up? Ah. Oh. 
Oh, I was supposed to go this way. Okay. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the show! Bizarre show. That's quite enough of that, I think. Enough preliminaries. Here's the performance you've been waiting for. Proves I am without prejudice and have a fine sense of humor. Okay, but Alice knew this was going to happen, right? Here, I invite everyone to dance. Laborers, lawyers, shirt and gown all make their little pranks. This life is full of random deaths and heaps of grief and shame. So few are sued by accident. You want someone to blame? Fire, plague, and strange disease. Drowned, murdered, or if you please. A long fall down the basement stairs. None expected. No one cares. Is the walrus a misogynist? It's really hard. Sweat running down my skin. After the dance, I then must rest, and the eating can begin. Time to eat. Death is the ultimate equalizer. All have the right. To be eaten. <laughs> Get a knife, princess. Don't push. All will be served, so to speak. Wicked thing, feasting while Wonderland is destroyed. I'm not the enemy you seek, Alice. I tried to hide this bit of Wonderland from that beast. Appeasement's never clean. We must all play our assigned roles. Are you a pawn or a queen? An idiot or a practiced fool? However, this turns out. Consider the prospect that you've been misled, Alice. Then ask, by whom? No! Who set that bloody train in motion? Where does it come from? It arrived when you arrived. And it's more horrible even than you can currently imagine. The death of a dream caterpillar may know how. That was horrible. What? Blood in my mouth tastes like bile. Where's the brute that hit me, Nanny? Nasty prats out cold. Not dead, and more's the pity. What did he want? What they all want. Money he didn't earn. What were you thinking, butting into that mess? You could have been killed. Nanny, my mind's in pieces. I still have terrible visions, and I need to know. Out the fire. Same as always. You need to move on, Alice. So do I. Well, at least she's not spewing that asylum nonsense. My past is dead. I killed them. I should have saved them. I should have died. Her mind was in shambles. Radcliffe thought familiar faces would bring her round. After a year, he lost interest in their inheritance. Greedy sod. Still, always asking his bizarre questions. Heavy dose of madness, I'd say, but honesty is never the best policy in this life. When she wasn't comatose, she gaped. Eyes like pinwheels, drooled, and occasionally squeaked. Never uttered a sensible sound. And like the child she was, she kept her secrets close. Gone off some lurkers, common as cockroaches. And those poor tykes of food for perverts, like the blameless ants that wasps consume or spiders feeble prey. You visited my room at Rutledge. What you were you call that? Radcliffe paid me for a bit. A woman alone sometimes does what she doesn't particularly feel like doing, as you know. Nurse Whitless said you'd fallen on hard times. I'm no drunk like her. I'm hurting no one. Hookham's not a bad life. Except for the pimps. She also said you might have my rabbit. Please, Nanny, talk about the damn fire. Never seems to help. Look, Alice, I can't give you what I don't have. Radcliffe wrote the inquest report. I'll take you to him. Besides, he's got your damn rabbit. You should remember that. All right, but Mr. Radcliffe's useless. <sighs> don't I know it? Okay, I fuck with the nanny. She's very cool. Also, that was a lot of fucking cutscenes, but I love it. I do. I do. I do like it. It's a lot of story coming in at once, and it's nice. Look at her conversating. Also, those cutscenes were very telling. I will say they were very important. I think to the story. Wow, dude. Can we just experience the soundtrack for a bit?
That is very fucking beautiful. It's like a music box version of the Alice soundtrack. It's just so fucking nice. I actually really love that. Where do I go? I don't remember actually. Not this way. Uh, I mean, everything is pretty enclosed, but I still want to see what's going on here. A funeral? Your masks. They're creepy as shit. Also, this is the fanciest woman that I've seen in this game this whole time. God damn. I know y'all see what I see. Anyways, this is a very cool environment. I never realized like all of the uh, like background people going on in here, but I guess this would be like the richer area of it, which makes sense because we're about to go see Radcliffe who like has money. I don't know. This is super interesting. I should have taken more time to like look at the backgrounds of things while I was playing this because there's a lot going on here. Little, Mr. Radcliffe. Ah, oh, you're back. I suppose you better come up. Mind the latch. I'm like stunned by this. Funnily enough though, his house looks almost exactly the same as the orphanage. Like, you know, similar wallpaper, but I guess there's less people living in here at once, which is the luxury about it. Yeah, so this guy's got a lot of like East Asian kind of like pottery going on in here. He's just a fan. Hey, that fixture is an animal crossing. Okay, no more wasting time. I gotta go. Okay, maybe a little more wasted time. The ancient scroll is parchment and the characters are drawn in Indian ink, which Radcliffe claims the Chinese invented eons ago by mixing soot, lamp oil, gelatin of the donkey skin and musk. He does know some remarkable things. I wonder if that's correct. I should look that up. Radcliffe, who can make even fascinating subjects boring, says the curved blade is a 16th century Meito Katana. I'm sorry if I pronounced it incorrectly. And the shorter sword is called the Wakizashi. That is definitely mispronounced, but I did try. Both used by Japanese samurai. Cool. Very interesting. All right, no more reading. I gotta talk to this motherfucker. You do have my rabbit. Forgotten your manners? What else, I wonder? You abandoned it at Rutledge Asylum, my dear. We've been over this before. In a huff as usual, oozing with attitude and accusatory flummery, I've stolen her rabbit. Ridiculous pretext. She's here about the fire again. All the mad child wants to talk about. My report found her family dead by misadventure. She won't accept it. It goes on and on about her killing memories and her need to know the truth. The alleged truth is the fire began in the library when the cat knocked over a lamp. The blaze trapped her parents and sister upstairs. Sister Lizzie never even unlocked her door, died in her bed. The guilty cat always sets her off. She denies it, makes no sense, it can't be, etc. Agreed. From the outset, Alice was my candidate for the pyromaniac. The girl had a fixation with fire. And I once remarked that I thought she might have had a larger role in causing the tragedy. She suffered some sort of psychotic episode. Damn, so he remarked it first and that's what made her think that she killed them? Did I rip his head off? I wanted to. Oh. What's left of my brain will explode. Is it mad to pray for better hallucinations? Perhaps I'm fated to expire right here. Where are we? Oh, I think this is perhaps a delusion. What's happened? All movables and effects are gone. Nothing but dust, stains, and the smell of tobacco. No sign of the coroner's report or my rabbit either. Damn him. Yeah, okay. Also, the music in this part's also really good. I used to listen to this all the time, just like doing my homework and shit. Very nice. Now oh, it's all fucked up in here. That's so creepy. Whoa, okay. I guess we should continue. That looks like, ooh, that looks like black slime. Gotta say, I'm not sure there's better environment design. The barricade discourages squatters, suggests he didn't sell up, just left quickly. I can't get through this way, but I recall the place had a door in the back that opened on the lane. Oh, so it's implying that he moved. Wait a minute, so was is the last part the hallucination of actually seeing him in the house or is this the hallucination i'm suspecting this but that's kind of weird anyways love the environment design of this fucking game Ooh, yeah this is the delusion has to be oh that's fucked up mm, i think there's a preliminary level before we reach the asian level so let's finish that and then we will yeah look at how fucked up it is we will finish this level get to the asian level play a little bit of that and then we will continue from there mm. Damn, she's probably having a psychotic episode in that poor fucking doctor's house. I mean, not poor doctor. Fuck that guy. He's kind of a dick, so. Ruin. It's corrupting all of Wonderland. Seeking refuge from the wicked world. Perhaps things only look like they've gone to hell. You're not that good a liar, and I'm not that stupid. But something a bit less calamitous would have been welcome. 
This unmitigated disaster is your doing, and it will get worse. Your train keeps a hellish schedule. Get schedule? Time waits for no one. The change has begun. The train is perfectly capable of terrifying me, Cat. You should find another job. Is there really so little hope? There's even less, and if fear paralyzes you, we are lost. Oh, no, 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 no. I love how casual she is about all this. She only screams sometimes. I forgot the hell that is the level before the Asian level. All right, time to hit the Zaza. Shit. I remember this level being low-key, like, really fucking buggy, so let's hope it doesn't do that to us this time. Remember the last time I played, I sent an enemy off the fucking corner, and it wouldn't let me progress the game because it didn't register him as dead. You guys won't know this, because I'm gonna employ a little bit of movie magic here, but this level is quite long. Like, longer than I want it to be, really. Actually, from here on out in the game, there's not a whole lot that I remember. I feel like the first level I remember so much because I replayed that so many more times than I've, like, replayed the- ooh, pretty! so many more times than I've actually repaid the entire game. So this is a little bit past my head, so. New weapon hours. I get to fight something ho fucking horrible with this right now, I think. Better not be the Colossal Ruin. Mm, no, doesn't sound like Colossal Ruin music. I actually really hate the Teapot Cannon. Oh, that is the Colossal Ruin. Fuck, I might have to use this. Shit. Oh, he's gonna have room to move around too. Shit. Can we make it without him like running after us? Maybe if I don't get close enough, I just shoot him from the distance. Fuck. Oh, he's killing me. <gasps> no, he is. No, 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 I'm stuck. Oh, <laughs> I hate this motherfucker. Stay far away from you. No, don't turn on fire mode. Don't turn on fire mode, please. No, no, no. Come on, die, 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 die. He's stuck. I think he's glitching out. Okay, cheers. Keep glitching. <gasps> no, uh-uh. Okay, yeah, he's stuck. He's stuck. Okay, well, God bless for glitches. I hate you. I hate you in particularly, not you, the viewer. <sighs> okay, cool. Thank God for glitches. I feel like I'm not gonna get that lucky throughout the rest of the game, but if I do, I would not complain. Whoa, what is the abyss? Is this... Okay, I guess that's walkable. Oh, this is crazy. Are these seashells? I think this is implying that this was the underwater level. Oh, and like the Hatter's Domain. Oh, so it's like, I think it's a mix of like all the domains just being torn up. Look what's become of my beautiful valley. All things change in the fullness of time, often not for better. Oh, I see. It's the Veil of Tears. That's kind of fucked up. I liked the Veil of Tears. Okay, getting to switch between my weapons is a pretty cool little mechanic of having that teapot cannon. Because when one runs out, I can use the other long-ranged one. I think it actually glitched again, so it doesn't know that the fucking villain died. Yeah, it glitched again. And always right there, too. Memory. Catastrophe may strike even the best regulated families, Miss Lynn. Of course, one family's disaster may be another family's opportunity. And the same goes for a surviving family. Ooh, scummy. Never mind. I hope he deals with my breakdown back at home. There's too many damn collectibles in this game. God. Too many villains, too many platforms. You know, I complain about this game like I hate it, but I really don't. It is, again, one of my favorite games. It's easy, but it's frustrating. Never mind, it wasn't done. Fuck. What's this right here? That's cool. Oh, is it part of the train and Hatter's Domain? Okay, yeah, there it is. This is a mix of a bunch of different places. All right, and the Veil of Tears. Oh, that's dope. Oh, it's like lava now. That's so cool. And I was here earlier. Wow, I love the continuity. Oh, that's cool. There's the, the little mech level that we went through with the fist that we had to like dodge and shit. God, there's so many of these fucking flying assholes. Yeah, you. I need that memory, but how do I get it? Okay, I think I gotta go around, that's why. That is crazy cool though, you gotta admit. Like, just the environment around this? I actually despise how many fucking different routes are in this level. It's an in-betweener, damn it! Shouldn't be this long. Okay, what's up here? Gotta go do this first. Listen, and the completion is part of my brain doesn't just allow me to walk right past it either. It's like, you have to do that or President Biden himself will come and shoot you in the head. Malark. I guess this place would stink. Why is there two in this fucking level? Who the fuck let that happen? I- I hate that. Plus other enemies? No, fuck you. 
<gasps> no, 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 no! Why am I dodging into him? What kind of fucking game mechanic is that? Are you fucking kidding me? Oh, I want to die. I want to die. Why is there two? And more of the fucking floaty bullshit motherfuckers. Oh, I'm going to corner myself if I go that way. Get the fuck out of here. Nobody likes you, okay? Get a fucking clue. Ah, fuck. Okay, okay. Well, those guys and now a fucking little one. Of course, of course. I can't have any fucking peace in this world. Why would I? Why would I be allowed such peace? Okay, pick him up. Pick him up. Pick him up. He's a walking being. He's fine to eat. Okay, get blocked. Get blocked. Okay, yeah. He's gonna try and come over here, so that's fine. If you're gonna do your little fucking fire bullshit, do it right there. And please don't break free from your little shackle over there. I'm begging you. I'm begging you. Ah, fuck. Eat shit. Like, literally eat shit and die. Eat shit and die. But I'm too far for him to get fired up, I think. Okay, this is fine. This is okay. No, it's when he's almost dead. Don't kill me. Don't kill me. Come on. Die before that happens. I'm losing so much health. Oh. Okay. Will this kill him? Please, bro. Why do you have so much health? I hate you. This is worse than any boss could ever be. Especially because he's just horrifying. Oh, God. 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 <sighs> That's horrible. I hope this level's almost over. What kind of bullshit is two colossal ruins at once? Would you, wouldn't you guys know it? I've been recording for 52 minutes. You guys have probably watched the sun go down out there, actually. It's probably gotten darker in my recording room as I, as I recorded this. Because it's been so fucking long. It's not only about you, Eris. Look at the destruction around you. Consider its cause. Then come join me. This guy is so helpful. I appreciate that. I think. Are those gold teeth? They are. Okay, I have to go do that. Okay, actually, girlies, we're only doing this level today. I'm so sorry. This is taking it out of me. Plus, I'm gonna go eat ramen after this. I got a little date happening. I'm not about to wait for ramen. No, sir. I gotta go around? Are you fucking serious? This game makes me want to kill myself. Oh, I wish I did have wine for this video. As you can see, I did not drink wine, partially because I just didn't want to use the same gimmick for another video, and nobody, like, really asked for it either but like wine would have been nice here all this just for some fucking teeth oh i think i have enough for another weapon now actually let me go ahead and do that okay vorpal blade or pepper grinder or hobby horse i think i'm gonna go with pepper grinder because pepper grinder is gonna be super useful for the next round i think nice okay cool ultimate pepper grinder activated all right get me out of this shit You are familiar with the saying that smoking stunts your growth. Adults assault children with that adage, usually while they've got a pipe stuck in their mouths. That's so real. I won't ask you to inhale. Let the smoke envelop you. That is so pretty. This is such a pretty level. Mysterious East. That's what it is. Okay, that was a bitch and a half. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and end it right here. Um, Wait, let's take this in really quick. That's cool. That's cool. That's very cool. And we will leave it at that. So thank you guys for coming to another Illuminati video. I appreciate you guys coming back after that little bit long hiatus there. I do plan on continuing this and I will see you guys next time. All right, love you guys. Bye.